Months after a Florence couple was found murdered in their home, their family is hoping the shred of a new clue could be the key to unraveling the mystery of Bill and Peggy Stevenson's deaths. My news reporter Bryce Hanslinger is live at the Boone County Sheriff's Office covering Northern Kentucky News now. Bryce? Well, Clyde, the Stevenson family is hoping that anyone with information about how Bill and Peggy Stevenson were killed will call the Boone County Sheriff's Department. This investigation has been ongoing for over three months, and the Stevenson family is still looking for answers. Dozens came out to Union Baptist Church to pray for the family of Bill and Peggy Stevenson. The Florence couple was a big part of this congregation. Bill was a deacon and Peggy was a longtime organist. And every time we turn around, there's a ministry that we realize isn't getting done because they're not here. The Stevensons were found dead in their home on Ridge Edge Court near Florence Sunday, May 29th. A family member found them after they became concerned that the Stevensons hadn't shown up for church. Tonight, the Union Baptist congregation hopes the public has not forgotten about the Stevensons or that a killer is on the loose. If someone out there knows something, please, please call Crime Stoppers, call the police, and we just are pleading that, that someone will come forth. Along with his work at Union Baptist, Bill Stevenson ran a truck stop ministry at the Travel Centers of America truck stop on Burlington Pike. The huge impact the Stevensons had on their community was seen in early June when hundreds came to Florence Baptist Church for their funeral. Those same friends and family members are still looking for closure. Just please continue to pray for them and remember them as they just wait until something breaks. And the Boone County Sheriff's Department is hoping that a recent tipster who called Shelbyville, Kentucky Police will give them a call. They're hoping to get more information and of course anyone that calls with information can re remain anonymous. Clyde. All right, Bryson Slinger reporting live for us tonight in Burlington.